Welcome everyone to HFN, also known as HUFN News. Today's the 17th day of March 2021. You guys can already tell from the price chart, we are going to give you all a price prediction for AMD stock. Now let's take a look at the market overall from our last price prediction, which was on the 20th of February 2021, and it was wrong. We got it incorrect. We were trying to play the strength and the market at AMD at that particular time and obviously you can tell we went the opposite direction the market in AMD fell so we're going to break all of that down and then we're going to pay attention to what has occurred since that price prediction to gauge where the market price is going to go in the future so that we can win okay we focus in on what the trap drops on the price chart so that we can see precisely where price is going to go so that we can win and he loses so hit that like button share the video and also subscribe to the channel you may want to tap that bell notification as well i mean, I mean just give me all the heads up so you do not miss out on any other price changes price predictions we are garnering here on this platform now let's break this down we got it wrong february the 20th right here we were expecting the market in amd to maintain the strength in the space and we were already seeing the market weakness come through but we found out right there on the 18th of february that the trap came in and propped up the market but you know what immediately the next day after we did our price prediction we saw the market go down right here and tested that ascending line so now obviously during the next three or four days of our price prediction being in play this market tried to show us strength so we really wasn't worried in our prediction as of what february 23rd and 24th just yet because the market tried to break back up above that ascending line which we needed to see that in order to at least keep our prediction in play now it occurred on february the 25th right here that that was not going to occur that the market price was not going to come back up above that ascending line it was confirmed right there on the 25th so yes we got it wrong okay so we probably would have gotten out in that prediction down here which is about 7.62 percent which is matter of fact where the market closed yesterday okay so we've been in down about 7.62 percent overall but let's say that you are a fearful for a trader and you got down at the ultimate low into the market around 74. It's been about 16, almost 17 percent market forecast loss right there. And it happens. But you know what? We learn from it and we move forward. We lose those soldiers and we make sure we try to bring them back by placing more soldiers into the market. So let's take that away. OK, now I'm going to zoom out. And you can see that generally the market in AMD is trading in a trading channel. Now, let me show you that. OK, I'm going to show you this first area here to which the market in AMD is in a trading channel. OK, that is the restriction area. And this is the support area in the market in AMD. Right there so you can see it he is telling us already what's going on into the market for amd take a look you can see how we've been bouncing to and fro into the channel and then we broke out but now we came right back in so i'm still expecting the market in amd to trade within the channel and as we see this market accrue more pricing information we will either break that to the downside or we'll break it to the upside. Okay. So let's go ahead and do this real quick. So that's pretty good. I mean, at least we understand what the current environment is into the market in AMD. So taking a look at this on a three day time frame. So right now, the market in AMD is pretty much stable and calm. We don't see a lot of volatility to really come in play to indicate that the market is going to break this trend uh, not yet but generally the strength is now back into the market to where we came and suppressed and held price right there around 74 dollars so now obviously the next restriction area 
is going to be up there towards our restriction line of about $86.50 to $88. That is where price is anticipated to go over the next couple of trading days. And looking at this on the five day time frame, the market at AMD looks decent. You know, I don't expect it to go lower, at least on the five day time frame. And even here on the weekly time frame, we're seeing the market in AMD still give us strength. I do like on the weekly time frame that we were able to close last week above $80, right? The ultimate area of support though for us on our prediction is going to be around $78.25. But looking at all these varying time frames, the market in AMD is still harnessing strength. Now, it doesn't mean we're out the woods yet. It just simply tells us from a weekly to a five day, three day to a daily time frame that there is still strength here to be had into the market. Now, outside of a three week time frame, the market can still dip in AMD. Now, God forbid. If we were to break the support area into the market in AMD, we can see this market in AMD drop. Let's just say from this support line, the next area of support is going to be around $59.25. That is a 20% drop. That will literally let us know that the overall market in AMD has completely changed and that we are now entering what some people may term a bear market. Now we don't see that right now because the market is still able to prop itself up right there around $74.25. So we're not going to place that on the table just yet, but we can see that if the market breaks that support area to the downside. So let's do this. We're going to continue to play the strength into the market in AMD based off the information that we now have and that we now can see. We said that $86, I would say the first area of restriction is going to be around 85. Okay. $85 is the first area of restriction, but we're going to bring it up there towards our restriction line of about $87, maybe even 88. And we're going to continue to play that out into the market. Okay. Support is around $77 and 50 cents. All right. So, Overall, so long as we don't break the support area to the downside, we're going to continue to trade in this channel and the prospect of higher price is still on the table. OK, so this is our updated price prediction into the market in AMD. This is what we're expecting the market to do. And now it is your turn. What is your expectations as to AMD and where price is headed? Because if you don't think the same way we do or you don't see the same thing we see on the price chart, let us know in the community. Tell everyone what you expect price to be in the next three weeks and get in position. Make sure you maintain the profitability and as always, trade different.